everybody, it's your boy SBX, another hip hop video we did. Uh, I want to talk about uh, the relationship with uh, 21 Garbage and Amber Thought Rose. The fucking Caillou looking, ball headed, Super Saiyan looking, Cisco from Drew Hills looking ass bitch. A light skinned version of Cisco. You know? I want to say, like, you know, I'm, 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 I'm going to talk about both people. But since this is, this is referring to women, and I'm talking about this woman or this bitch, I'm going to, let's say ladies first. I'm going to go with Amber Rose for a minute. I, I've got 21 garbage later. He's, he's going to be next, trust me. So first and foremost, you know, like I said, I have mentioned things about Amber Rose for a minute. And I might do it again another time, but, you know, I'm going to talk about her perspectives a little bit and why she's dating another victim and her fighting type of vic uh, victim list, a little black book of victims that she's going to fuck around, she fucked around with. Now, Amber Rose is known for being a former stripper, just like... Oh, Black China and Cardi B and the rest of these fucking hoes. And I feel like Amber Rose is really a, a, not a good example of a role model for women. I said the same thing with Nicki Minaj. And I even say feminist is, feminism is also a bad example for women. You know, it, it is to me honest, women nowadays don't even have a role model. The, the old role models would have been the women who were the civil rights leaders, the women who invented things, a, a strong mother, or whatever. They might say they moms, but it really all depends on how they view their mom, how the circumstances, circumstances of how their moms are, you know. It's just that. With, like I said, Amber Rose is not a good role model. Is because, okay, she's a, she was a stripper, and just like Kim Kardashian and Black China, she screwed her way into the business. And the first victim she fucked around with was old, dumbass, delusional, narcissistic ass Kanye West. You know, they were in a relationship at one point of their lives. But despite the fact that I said uh, Kanye West was a dumbass, he actually made a smart move to let Amber Rose go. It's because of whatever she he views her as a um, as a girlfriend or whatever the case it may be. But Amber Rose is known for being a hoe, and she does hoeish behaviors, and she admit that she's a hoe. So Kanye West wasn't happy. But even though he um, is with another bimbo, you know, <laughs> Kanye West made a good choice to let her go. Then, around, I believe, 2000 and about 12, if I'm not mistaken, I'm 13. I mean, it's been a while. I mean, I don't even I don't even pay attention to shit like this, but I've known that uh, Amber Rose did, however, date and marry Wiz Khalifa. And I'm not even a fan of his music either, you know? I mean, sometimes he has some decent songs, but in most cases, I'm not feeling his flow. But the point of the matter is that when Amber Rose was about to do some real thotty shit, it went on to uh, Wiz. And Wiz was being a simp. It's because he felt like he was in love. He felt like this woman could have been a one. He didn't care what she done or what was her background or whatever, he was in love with the girl. You know what I'm saying? And later on, pretty much Amber Rose tossed him aside like he's some old pair of shoes. 
And that's fucked up. You know, and people assume that, oh, Amber Rose did it for the better, or Amber Rose is just being a, a selfish bitch. I could think the selfish bitch part could fit her description. And most likely, Amber Rose only hold on to assholes and fall in love with assholes. You gotta treat her like shit. Just like the uh, dumb generic bitches who prefer dating thugs and, uh, or guys who are rich or whatever. Superficial type bitches follow up to superficial relationships and superficial people. So, you know, on top of that, um, like I said, Wiz Khalifa was pussy trapped and got her pregnant and now he had to pay a low sum of, of money for child support to take care of her son. So now it's like Amber Rose is promoting what is called the slut walk. And it's supposed to be a, I, it's not even, I don't know, I don't even know what the fuck it is. I, I never heard no shit like that, the slut walk. It's like a, I, I just can't, I can't even, I can't even think about it, but it's, it's, it's like a movement where women, should be free to be who they want to be as a hoe. Like they're trying to, it's trying to say that you should be a hoe, but at the same time respect my body. Like what the fuck? How can you say that you want men to respect your body and say no means no, but you fucking around with different people and can't tell yourself no to stop fucking around with all these niggas it's a it's very hypocritical and it's contradicting because you know you're 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 getting these bitches heads saying that you it's okay to be a hoe it's like saying be a prostitute if the money is looking right we can fuck we can be in a relationship and again that's not what a role model should be and act like and how to start a movement. It's already worse as it is with feminism, bitching about patriarchy and wanting women's rights and claiming that society is unfair to them. And then when you and when 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 women give the when, when women have all the opportunities in the world as far as getting alimony, uh, child support, freedom to do this, freedom to do that, be respected. All that nice guy persona hits the fucking window, goes out the window, and they they want more. They want to be this, they want to be that, they want to do this, they want to do that. So, now it's at the point where a woman want to be very seductive and want to show her ass and start twerking on these uh, social media sites, rather this Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, whatever, showing off. But yet, you it's okay for you to look like a hoe, but you only would fuck like a hoe if you feel like it, but you know deep down you're a hoe, but you don't want to admit that, but you promote your ways to be saying it's okay to walk and act like a hoe, but you don't want to be treated with the bad as if you are a prostitute, so it's like you can't have the cake and eat it, that's the whole concept what I want to tell you, you know, and now she's dating victim number three, which is this dumb fucking nappy headed cookie monster looking ass nigga 21 Savage aka 21 Garbage you know like first and foremost just like all these new rappers 
I'm gonna be quick with it and say that his music is ass. You can't rap just like all these other mumble rap dumb motherfuckers. You know, oh yeah, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21. 21. So fucking retarded. Turn up, turn up, turn up, turn up, turn up. Well, and like he's repeating himself like he's a fucking Pokemon. Or Timmy from South Park. That's what he looked like. He looked like Timmy from South Park. All he needs is that fucking wheelchair. You know? Turn up! 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, and not only his music sucks, but this guy is a is is is, is the new like he's like not even just new he is the 2017 simp. He is the simp of the year because he is with Amber Rose and some people. Rather, if it's some brainwashed goat people who have nothing to do but get on these dumb social media sites and people with a fucking mind will tell you that Amber Rose is bad news. So, it's kind of like dating Erica Badu and what happens to the man who dated Erica Badu and made a, a big change. I'm not saying Erica Badu is the worst person in the world. She's a great artist, but she will change people. She will change a man from being who he is to this Afrocentric type of shit. But the, the difference is, is that Amber Rose will manipulate and suck the sword out of your fucking heart and also your pockets. Um, 20, like I said, 21's garbage is, is in for a rude awakening. And he's being such a simp. And Amber Rose is a lot older than him. He's like old enough to be his big sister or something. But yo, anybody will do anything just to fuck her. I mean, look, she got, she got a fat ass, she got big titties, she look good, even though she look like fucking Caillou, she look like Cisco turning Super Saiyan, I realistically wouldn't date Amber Rose, hell, even fucking her would be a no-no, cause when you fuck girls like Amber Rose, Black China, or Superhead or Cat Stacks or whoever on Instagram or anybody from social media, they will basically change and use you for whatever purpose. You know, it's like these women have nothing to offer in this world. They don't entertain, they don't sell anything but sell their assets. As in, literally, they sell their ass on social media. Like, they're like the social media prostitutes or the, or the internet hoes or whatever you want to say. Because they're only here to look good for themselves and it's only eye candy for the viewers. You know? And that's the reality of it. You know? And people. People need to stop giving these bitches attention, you know? I mean, like I said, yes, they look good, but inside of that, all that face and all that ass and all those fake titties, it's nothing but insecure, troubled feet. And most of these bitches come from a troubled, bad environment with a fucked up family life or a fucked up relationship with who they are today, you know? And American women are very toxic because they're promoting nothing but garbage and people want to eat it up like it's fucking cake. You know what I'm saying? 
But like I said, 21 Savage is a fucking simp because he's doing everything in his power to be with her and supporting her little slut walk movement. <laughs> oh my god, it is so fun. It's, it's fun, bro. It's very, very fun. I, I, this is why, with me, rather I'm going somewhere in my life, rather if I'm going to school, rather if I have to go to work, rather if I got to go to the supermarket, I'm going to always be around stupid, illiterate, delusional motherfuckers. This, this is the generation of stupid people promoting stupid shit, doing stupid things to get themselves famous. There is no, there is no role model, no female role models for the women out there. Because your role models are whores. Think about it. I mean, like I said, Amber Rose, Black China. Fucking Kim Kardashian, Superhead. What's next? Lil Kim. I'm sorry, I love Lil Kim, but she's showing off. Nicki Minaj. Um, let's go back to Marilyn Monroe. Another whore. You know what I'm saying? Back then, women are not supposed to be idolizing these type of females. Nowadays, it's like, it's okay and act and be just like these hoes. But you know you don't want to be a hoe, but you want to act as if it's okay to be one. Women got to really twist it up in the Western society. And this is why a lot of guys are going foreign. This is why they go into Dominican Republic, why they go into Brazil, why they go to uh, Philippines, Thailand, or uh, Ukraine, or whatever. Because these women are not brainwashed to be acting this way. And they think, some of them might think this is stupid, but I wouldn't be surprised that there are four women who like this garbage. Or have something that relates to the bullshit. But the point of the matter, what I'm trying to say to y'all, is that Amber Rose is toxic is cancer. She's like a tumor in your head, in your ass, and in your pockets for all the sympaths in this. You know what I mean? She, I, I don't think, like I said, I don't even think she deserved to be famous all for because of all she did. So anyways, so folks, I'm done here. Please leave a comment in the comment section below. Like and subscribe. SBS. I'm out. Peace the fuck out.